Okay, you guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make this pattern. Looks like that. You can switch colors like I'm going to do if you want it. If not, you can just do it like that. And obviously, you can choose different colors. I have just this one, so that's what I'm using. I'm going to use this different color bead to put it at the end of the thread. So that work can stay and now slip down i'm going to leave a little bit of tail you guys need to leave about eight inches or so and pass the needle once or twice if you need it as long as you can slip it down like that that's all we need okay me i don't care so i'm gonna pass it twice because i can cut the thread you know and get rid of it and stuff so i do not need a tail because i dissolve my work right after i finish when i done with my work i just take this out so just like that do not forget to leave enough tail pass the needle through the cb at least once okay if you can take it af after you make it, you know, pass it twice, go ahead and do it. If not, besides, it's, it's kind of easy to take it out. All you have to do is put the needle like that. See? And it's easy to take it out. So pass it twice. Pass the needle twice through the CB so the CB get stuck like that. All right? So we're going to begin with this pattern. All right? Like you guys see, this one is size 8, this one is size 6. So, there you have it, two different sizes, just like that. Alright, you're going to begin now. We're going to begin with three dark blue. Like so. Okay, you guys, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to make this pattern. But this time, I do not go into tag. So I hope you guys can understand me better. We're going to begin now. So, we put three CBs like that. We pass the needle through the three of them like this once. And we pass the needle through two. To make this like some kind of circle, that's all. Try not to make nuts in your work because it's so hard to undo those nuts, okay? Go as low as you can, you don't have to go really fast. I leave the stopping bit right there so it's easy for me to grab it just like that and work from there. So right here, we're gonna put two at a time in each one of these sides. We count. One. Two. Three. Right here is the last one, so we're going to pass the needle through two, like that. Every single time we end up the turn, that's how it's going to be. All right? So, like that. It looks like that. That was the second turn. 
the third one is going to be light blue like this dark blue every single time you escape one pass the needle through the next one that is how it's going to work this work the stitch that we're making that is how it works escape one pass the needle through the next one except for the ones in this part that always have to be pick up two pass the needle through the next one not not escape any right there all right and right here we're gonna escape one add one right there pass the needle through the next one pick up two more of light blue pass the needle through the next one like so one dark blue Right here is the last one, so we escape one and we pass the needle through the last two. Like so. Obviously, you guys can choose any colors you guys like it. I do have just these two colors handy, so that's exactly what I'm using. But you guys can make a better combination, combination in everything, alright? I do not even know how to combine the colors properly, so I just grab whatever I have handy. That is how I work. So, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, so. Light blue. We pick up two, pass the needle through the next one. right here we're gonna get to one dark blue two dark blue light blue and each of these three points just like that count two One, two, two of light blue, pass the needle through the next one. Now, one dark blue, two dark blue. This is the last one. We step up, like so. Light blue. Pass the needle through the next one, like so. So this turn is going to be blue, and each side we're going to, we need to have four. So we count one, two, three, four. Count four like that. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. All right, so it's the whole side all the way. Total of five. If you count this one on a point right here, count one, two, three, four, five. All right, same on the other side. Light blue. Light blue. One more light blue.
right here we need two light blue like you guys see these ones come out really really nice they have all the same size this one is size um like you guys see the z beads they have the same size and if you buy the way i did when i get these ones first i didn't know how they come out i thought because they were cheap they're going to be you know the same size because they say they have like three sizes but when you select those beads you might got three sizes but if you didn't select it then you got all kind of sizes you know like thick light you know in big small and all that horrible like you guys see right here 